With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. In the given question, we have to evaluate the following using identity. So here the first part of the question is equals to here it is a square b minus b square a and then whole square. So here we first expand this algebraic expression and here we use the identity which is x minus y whole square is equals to x square plus y square minus 2xy. So here, here this part is x and this part is y. So here we get a square b and then square plus b square a and then here it is square minus 2 into a square b and then into b square a so here now we simply solve it and here we use the two identities of exponent according to which a raised to power m raised to power n is equals to a raised to power m into n so here power simply gets multiplied and here another identity which we use is a raised to power m into a raised to power n is equals to a raised to power m plus n so here so here the power simply gets multiplied so here we get a raised to power 2 into 2 here it is a raised to power 2 into 2 and here we get simply b raised to power 2 plus similarly here we get b raised to power 2 into 2 and here it is a raised to power 2 minus 2 into here the power simply gets add so here it will be 2 a raised to power 2 plus 1 and here we have used this identity so here similarly here the power of b also add so here it will be b raised to power 1 plus 2 so here here we get is equals to is equals to a raised to power 4 b square plus b raised to power 4 a square minus 2 a cube b cube so here this is the answer of the first part similarly in the second part the algebraic identity which we have to solve is equals to a minus 0 0.1 here it is a minus 0 0.1 and then into a plus 0 0.1 so here here it is a plus 0 0.1 so here here we use the another algebraic identity which is x minus y into x plus y is equals to x square minus y square so here this part is x and this part is y so here we get a square minus here it is 0 0.1 and then square so here we get a square minus 0 0.1 square will be equals to 0 0.01 so here that's our answer for class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.